Good afternoon, y'all. Um, Bug and I are here. And we're going to do a craft for St. Patrick's Day. Um, we're going to do like shamrock shirts. I've seen this on Pinterest. Um, so for this craft, you're going to need um, some freezer paper, um, whatever color uh, apple barrel acrylic paint you want, some scissors, um, a Sharpie, two pencils uh, that don't have any of the eraser used, and then just whatever color t-shirts you want. I'm doing white. I found a shamrock online and I cut it out to use as my stencil and then I just traced two out on my paper and I'm going to get those cut and then we'll be right back. Okay, we have now been joined by Bit who just woke up from his nap and I've got our paints here. These are the ones I'm going to use for his shirt. I'm just going to use a couple different greens and then Bug is going to use um, rainbow. And all I did for hers, I just kind of marked off which section is going to be which color for her. Um, and then you just iron this on. And inside I have um, just a piece out of a magazine so that the paint doesn't so that the paint doesn't leak through to the back side. And then I did the same thing with his shirt. Oh, hold on, you gotta leave it. And then all you do is use the eraser end of your pencil. Whoa. Whoa. And you're going to dip it into your paint. And then just tap it around that edge. And you're going to make it a little bit darker right on the stencil. But then kind of tap it out lighter the further away that you get. And now we're just going to work all the way around this and then I'll show them to you when we're all done. Okay, we finished uh, tapping around our stencils with our eraser. Um, I'm going to let the paint dry and then we'll peel that stencil off for the big reveal. All right, we got the stencils pulled off and there are their shirts for St. Patrick's Day. Uh, so they will be wearing these on Tuesday. Um, if you liked this video, make sure that you like it, uh, leave a comment, be sure to subscribe, and we will see you later. Have a good day.